It is a big decision for a lot of kids at Christmas. What to wish for in a letter to Santa. Millions of letters sent to jolly old St. Nick every year, but he's awfully busy this time of year and can't answer them all. That's where Santa's helpers come in. One San Antonio business has taken on that big responsibility. The night team's Patty Santos with how they're spreading Christmas cheer to kids and adults. A little red box bringing a community together. I never knew that people would get so much joy from it. Joy from simply receiving a letter in the mail, but not just any letter, a letter from Santa. With the old school notion of writing a letter and putting it in a mailbox and you see smile on their face. The owners of Gino's Deli at the corner of Hebner and Lock Hill Selma didn't know putting a mailbox for Santa's letters would be such a great hit. Happiness in the mailbox. This is the second year for Santa's letters. They also have a station where kids can write letters complete with everything they need. Pens, crayons, paper and envelopes. So far, they've received at least 500 letters. The owners have responded to every single one of them because we all know Santa can't respond to all of the letters that he receives. I'm just a middle person. The big guy in the North Pole, he does all the heavy lifting. Paige Chaudhry says that this activity fills her heart with joy and hope because it reminds her that kids have a big heart. And we have a lot of their children write letters saying, please keep my dad safe. Another sweet letter came from Angie. She wrote, my Christmas wish is for all humanity to receive love, hope, peace, and understanding. And kids aren't the only ones writing letters. I have a letter saying from adults, they want a $15 million non-tax deposit in the savings account. <laughs> 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 uh, I think it's fun for adults to, you know, to write to Santa. The Chandri says they'll keep this Christmas tradition going as long as they can. I feel that I'm doing something constructive for the community, for the city and stuff, you know, and I feel fulfilled. Patty Santos, KSAT 12 News. There is still time if your little one wants to mail their letter to Santa from Geno's. The last day is on Monday.